Hello, uh, my name is Hiren uh, Desai. Um, in last, last technical presentation, we talked about uh, fiber channel. In this one, we'll be talking about uh, uh, fiber channel over Ethernet or FCOE. So what is FCOE? Uh, as you can see here, we have a, a typical network diagram of an FCOE network. Um, here, you have a, a switch, which is typically known as a FCF, which consists of Ethernet, it's an Ethernet switch which provides you a fiber channel services, as we mentioned in some of the previous videos. You have you have a host or initiator hooked up via uh, an Ethernet cable or Ethernet network. You have a host or initiator um, going via an another Ethernet or a DCB switch connected to this FCF. And here you have a target or a storage device. Uh, hooked up. So as you can see, this is a complete Ethernet network or complete Ethernet fabric. Um, a second typical topology that's used is you would have what we call uh, NPIV or FCOE gateway, um, and you would have a Ethernet network uh, on the bottom where you have uh, all the host or initiators uh, hooked up. Uh, this picture doesn't show, but it can be via another switch or what we would call Ethernet cloud connect and connected to um, a fiber channel, existing fiber channel network. So you would have a, a COE host, we need some service or which needs to access some data which are in fiber channel, um, fiber channel network. So this switch is simply doing what we call a FCOE gateway functionality. And as you can see, below everything is Ethernet uh, on the top, everything is a uh, fiber channel. So these are two typical topologies which are deployed today. Um, we'll sort of break down into more detail of how each device is discover uh, the uh, FCF and how some of the logging process works. But before we go there, let me just give you a brief diagram of uh, FCOE frame. What is it? How does an FCOE frame looks like? So. You to draw this picture here. We would have a Ethernet header, including VLAN. We have a COE header. We would have the full FC frame, including FCCRC, and we would have what we call FCOE. Um, trailer and we would have the Ethernet CRC. So again this is an Ethernet frame that contains original FC frame and this would be about 2200, 2300 byte packet because um, so the, the way FCOE uh, frames are defined is the FC frame is never chopped into two. The full FC frame will be embedded into an, an, an Ethernet frame. So this is how, so when this host uh, or this initiator is sending frame, this is what it will be sending frame. This is how the frame will look like on the wire. 